look at some of the other top international headlines. The U.S. Navy investigation has ruled out any wrongdoing in the killing of one Indian fisherman in a firing incident off the Persian Gulf in 2012. The investigation, in fact, blames the unarmed fishermen for posing imminent threat and showing hostile intent. South Korea has condemned North Korea's threat to suspend operations at a joint factory complex and sever its lost economic link with its rivals. South Korea had issued a statement warning that the North Korea could uh, be held accountable for its actions. At least 15 people were killed and 53 were wounded when a suicide bomber detonated his vehicle in the central Syrian capital of Damascus on Monday. The blast occurred near Saba Baharat Square, one of the capital's biggest roundabouts. The son-in-law of Osama bin Laden appeared in a federal court in New York City in a procedural matter pertaining to the start of his criminal trial. Suleiman Abu Ghaid was charged with conspiring to kill Americans in his alleged role as Al-Qaeda's top propagandist after the 9-11 attacks. He's featured in several Al-Qaeda videos.